Around 50 days ago, I decided to use my cameras and my phone to vlog. My intention at that time was only attending a fan fest. But I really didn't even realize at the time why did I actually vlog. As I've always said, it's just a hobby, it's just an interest. But I didn't actually realize how immediately it developed. I ended up featuring different brands, showing you different contents. But I reached my breaking point. I was able to actually surpass that. But however, I think I'm still struggling. But I guess it's okay. It keeps me grounded. However, lately I've been receiving a lot of opportunities and blessings that would allow myself to grow as a creator. As a vlogger, I am happy, and now I think I realize that there are a lot of things to actually explore and have myself be responsible and take control on a lot of things around me. We have to be relevant. We have to stay on who we are and into our own context. But these are the things that would somehow, on a certain point, outbalances the things that you have to do. It's a challenge and a struggle for every creator out there. And trust me when I say that, I'm not the only one who's been actually experiencing this. It's nice for you to start traction, but developing and continuing that traction is always hard. You have to keep moving forward. And I guess I think right now is the right time for me to actually a step back and realize everything that's going to happen soon enough. There's a new chapter coming in. There's a new door about to open. There's a lot of more opportunities that are coming your way. But you have to stay grounded that makes you who you are. Push forward. Before we begin, I actually intended to just try, test out a new software that I've been using for editing. It's Wondershare Filmora. I haven't really explored it that much, but the first part of this video that you've seen it's all about that. So, that's just it. I'm fine guys, don't worry about me. It's just that I think these are the days wherein you're having some sort of reflection and thoughts lately on what would be the direction of the things that you're currently doing right now. It's actually also maybe a factor wherein my birthday is coming up and I'm ba I'm going to H again, but that shouldn't be an excuse, right? But I guess it's okay because I'm still able to actually create and do stuff that I actually happen to like and love. It's also a way for me to be thankful and be grateful on the opportunities and chances that I've been receiving and the exposures that I am getting. You don't really get this a lot. I mean, 
not on a regular job but it's still something that you should be actually be thankful in no matter how small i guess it's time for us to actually deliver let's see how this goes updates it is actually official that drinks on danny part three is actually on its way on october 11 and that's my birthday as well so if you guys would join it's not gonna be drinks on danny anymore it's gonna be drinks on me kidding kidding danny if you're watching this it is actually <laughs> his event it's just that it happened to be that i'm his captain and we're making it like a special one so all of my friends out there if you want to join or if you want to hang out with me come to uh on december uh, october 11 at kuchi bar at 7 p.m because we're gonna do a lot of stuff we're gonna do a pub crawl for everyone we're gonna bring out some drinks and we're gonna have to party and revel guest list be there and i think the night before that me and my friends will be having a little birthday salubong my close friends at escobar cantina i just recently made a feature brand content with them so check it out and i'm gonna link down the description of their social medias as well for the stops and drink danny you know what it is you know what's bound to happen. I've published it twice, but right now it's, it's going to be something more special. And tomorrow, well, because if you're going to see this Friday, I think. Tomorrow is Party Manila's Publish on Crawl. I, that's where I'm mainly happening, uh, a captain for. I've been doing that before I've done, I'm doing things on Danny. So... It's 250 pesos per person. We're handing out stops for the first 30 people. We're going to five stops in Poblacion that I haven't really featured much. So, you guys should actually hit me up. This is actually the poster. I guess that's just that. Um, I have to see you guys this weekend if you want to hang out and party with me in Poblacion Makari. That's how we're going to happen. And I want to actually see you guys. Oh, and on Sunday, Philippine American Football League. Watch it, 50 pesos per head. So everything's going to be fine, y'all. See ya.